All right, so I've cut one layer out, you can see here. So now I'm going to just make sure here. So I've just cut one layer, as you can see. I'm going to now make sure all the checks exactly match up to the side. Here, see, it's not matched up there, you can see. So we're going to bring this up here. My tripod's broken, so I've got to use, you have to bear with me. I've just got my handheld camera now. So it's a little bit awkward. So you can see, I'm just making sure exactly, checks exactly match here. So they're matching there, just making sure they're matching down there, exactly. There, 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 just bring that up. There, that's matching now. So now this is pretty much in. So you've got to match up exactly. This is why I cut the layers out, especially pronounced checks. I cut out in single layers. And also you need to make sure you get your ruler. I've got a big long ruler somewhere. It drives you mad sometimes, but you've got to try and get the checks to match. Be on the straight line, can you see? So that, that is... That was on the straight line because I did check before I cut it out. Can you see? You got to make sure the, the check lines run straight as well and going across as well. So yeah, that's pretty much in. Sometimes the weight's woven. Sometimes the actual lines can be off. So usually that's not really on high quality fabrics. On the, on the low quality fabrics, you usually get that thing. They're not straight on grain sometimes so there we have it everyone so i'm going to cut this out now i'm just, I'm just going to put a few pins in just to so it doesn't move whilst i'm cutting it but you can see uh, it checks exactly together the on the underside exactly so we'll go to the next stage ciao